Welcome to the VU Festival of Lights. Last year, the first Festival of Lights took place right here on this VU campus. This year, we celebrate through this recording. For a long period, our students have not been able to receive education and our staff has not been able to do their work in a normal way. And this beautiful campus was empty and lifeless for the past nine months. It turns out that it's not easy to feel connected, stuck in your own student room or in your improvised home office. And that's why we are organizing this Festival of Lights, this Lichtjesfeest again in this adapted version this year. Because we want to tell you the following. With this Festival of Lights, we seek connection. And with this Festival of Lights, we express that we miss each other. And with this Festival of Lights, we acknowledge that these are tough times for our community, for all of us. And with this Festival of Lights, we recognize the struggle many of us face. With this Festival of Lights, we show we are together as a Vrije Universiteit. Take care of yourself and know that you are part of our community. Good luck for this year and we hope to see you soon at campus again. On behalf of the USR, we light a candle. On behalf of the whole rainbow community at VU, I wish you warmth, light and gezelligheid. Campus Radio. Hi everyone. We know this year has been a very difficult one, and we've seen a number of students come forward wanting to tell their stories. These stories illuminate the different experiences that we have as VU community of these trying times. So on behalf of VU Campus Radio, we'd like to wish you happy holidays. I am Mark Lemay. I'm Jonathan Lund. And this is VU Campus Radio. As mayor of Amstelveen, I'm happy to participate in the Festival of Lights on the VU Campus. I light my candle for you to sympathize with you. From the heart of our student campus, Aulestede, I welcome you to the VU Festival of Lights. Aulestede is one of the largest student campuses in Europe and a place that many of our students call home. 2020 is drawing to a close. And if we look back on the year that's almost behind us, it's clear that this year has taken a toll on us. For the past nine months, our education, teaching, working and campus life was disrupted. And on behalf of the Diversity Office, I would like to wish everyone a prosperous 2021 and that we leave behind the darkness that 2020 and COVID-19 brought us. We're all very sad to not see you in person anymore uh, in the food, but we're Hope that you all stay safe and that we'll see each other again very soon. We, as SV Anatolia, are waiting for the moment we can meet again. Until then, stay home, stay safe. The COVID restrictions must be really tough for you. By lighting our candles, we reach out to each other. We feel connected and united as a community. As a community and as individuals, we've had to deal with illness, with quarantine, with worrying about the health and well-being of family and loved ones, and with the sudden disruption of familiar routines and practices. Many of us are dealing with fatigue, anxiety, and sometimes a sense of boredom. Some of us are grappling with loneliness and depression, especially if family is far away. We'll make sure that 2021 will be a better year. Give us all perspective to a brighter future, to physical education. There is light at the end of the tunnel. It is not in the nature of students to be alone all day. But you know, 
happiness can be found even in the darkest of times, if one only remembers to turn on the light. Green Office Who want to share our love to our friends and colleagues in the Who community. We know that this time has been tough and we could not experience the community life the way we used to. And even though the days are getting shorter, we hope you will always follow the light within. We think it's important to stay connected, open and hopeful. And from the Green Office Who, we wish you all a green holiday. I'm impressed by the way you cope with this extraordinary situation, by your resilience and resourcefulness to make the best of it. To all of you, but particularly to those who are struggling at this moment, I would like to say, hang in there, take good care of yourselves and reach out if you need help. Let's hope that in 2021, you will be able to meet each other in person again that you can study, work, dance, sport, chill, eat, go out, and of course, date with your fellow students. That life on the campus is bright and bustling as ever. That you can enjoy the richness and diversity of studying at the VU and being part of the VU community. And of course, being here in Amstelveen. I want you to know that my thoughts and best wishes are with all of you, wherever you are, here at Aalestede, elsewhere in the Netherlands, or in any other corner of the world that you may find yourself to be. Stay healthy and stay safe. And I want to say thank you to our student councils and student organizations. A lot of plans fell apart for you. Plans that you had worked on for a long time and you could not go ahead. But you all found a way to stay in touch with each other and continue to make plans. Last year we celebrated our first Festival of Light just outside 3D here on the campus square. Many of you were out here holding candles in the dark and it was an amazing sight. And uh, this year is quite different. It's really quite lonely here without you. For me, light is a vulnerable sign of hope in the darkness. For me, light is the confidence that even in uncertain times, light is the good. For me, Light is the only certainty I have after a long and dark night. For me, light is energy. For me, light is direction. For me, light is to laugh and have fun with people you can never spend enough time with. This is Abraham Kuiper. He is our founder, founder of the university. And this year we commemorate his, the centennial of his death. We hope that art and heritage may bring you some inspiration in these dark times. Our hearts especially go out to the first years. We're sure this isn't how you envisioned your college experience, but hopefully next year we'll bring some more adventures. Hi, my name is Ben de Wallert and I'm the art curator here at the VU, Vrije Universiteit. Um, behind me you can see an artwork which is made by Wafa Halush, and what you can see uh, is a thought that uh, uh, she was inspired by from Kuiper, in which she said we need hands, heart and head uh, to contribute to our society. I hope this very special thought helps you also in these challenging times. Esperamos que mantenham boa saúde e ficam felizes nesses dias difíceis. Ich hoffe, ihr bleibt alle gesund und habt schöne Weihnachtsfeiertage. Esperamos que estén bien, sanes y felices. Wir hoffen, dass ihr veilig und gesund bleiben und ein fein Kerstfest.